Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel, The Mom Life 7. Today I have another 99 cent store haul to share with you guys. And I'm kind of excited because today I'm going to announce my giveaway um, winners for my 500 uh, subscriber appreci appreciation giveaway. Uh, let me see. Um, I have, <laughs> I remember telling you guys I was cutting back on hauling, which I've been trying and I did like actually like not go out all week until I think like Friday. I believe it was Friday. Uh, well, someone, um, it's an employee at one of the stores that I go to had hit me and was telling me about an item that had came in that I was showing her. And so I did send the hubby to go grab the item and I think he grabbed like a few other things. But other than that, we really hadn't been out hauling. I just had been here trying to get stuff done around the house and spending time with my kids. And they've been driving me crazy because my daughter's home from spring break. So it's just been, I'm like so behind on everything, behind on other YouTubers watching their videos, responding to comments, just everything. I'm really behind. But anyway, I got quite a bit of stuff. So I really wanted to split it up in two videos, but I'm going to see if I can try to get it in one because I do want to announce the winner. So we'll see how it goes. I'm just going to play it by ear and see how it, go, how it goes. If you're new to my channel, welcome, welcome, welcome. And if you're a returning subscriber, thank you for uh, coming back again. Um, if you enjoy these type of videos, please give me a thumbs up and um, don't forget to, if you haven't already, subscribe and comment, share, all that kind of good stuff. Alright, so I don't want to waste too much time. I was planning on showing the uh, Easter baskets I did for the kids. So I may just have to do a quick video tomorrow on those. Uh, is that my smoke detector going off again? Oh, wow. I'm going to have to have one of my tall sons to come over here and change that for me, I guess, tomorrow, hopefully. Alright, anyway, so... Um, excuse that noise in the background I'm just now hearing it myself okay anyway let me show you guys what I got okay guys let me try to get the perishable stuff out the way um, we had ran into these uh, Pillsbury Grand's hot cocoa rolls I've never seen these before I had seen someone I think post them on Instagram and I was like wow I didn't know they had that flavor and uh, it says it's a limited edition you get five big rolls uh, let me see I think it's Spires next one. okay expires April 28th um, 2018 it's actually after midnight I know I was supposed to announce the giveaway winner on Saturday and it's technically Sunday because it's after midnight so this video should be up sometime Sunday on April 1st Easter um, because it's really late at night and so by the time my daughter edited it and do all that stuff it'll be up and then we also got these grands um, buttermilk biscuits you may have seen me use these in my chicken and dumpling video because this is the kind I use for my um, my dumplings. Uh, you get eight big, big biscuits. I'm sure everybody's familiar with this brand. Expiration date on this is April 25th, 2018. Okay, we have the Immaculate Organic Flaky Biscuits. You get eight ready-to-bake biscuits. It's non-GMO verified and it's USDA. Uh, organic, no, no bleach uh, flour, no artificial flavors, no preservatives, no hy hydrogenated oils. And for the expiration date, it's May 30th, 2018. And all this was 99 cent, by the way. If anything is different, I'll specify that. Okay. I was also really excited to find these uh, Pillsbury Ready to Bake Bunny um, shaped sugar cookies. You get 24 pre-cut cookies. Um, I was at my, one of my local grocery stores, and we get these all the time for the kids, for like the Christmas ones, whatever holiday is around. We'll grab these, and they love them. And so we was going to get some, and they were like, they're like two something, and we were like, uh, I said, you know what? Let's wait and see if they show up in the 99 cent store. And I'm glad I did. They showed up, and I got this for 99 cents. I got two of these, you guys. So we're going to be baking these, I guess, later on today, <laughs> since it's after midnight. Anyway, uh, let me see if I have a date for you guys. Yes, I do. It's, oh, it's my birthday. May 10th, 2018. All right. All righty. Mother's Day baby here. All right. Born on Mother's Day. All right. So up next, I have the Wild Alaska Pollock. Um, it's fish nuggets. Mild taste made from mint pollock. I don't know what these taste not like. Never had them before. I guess it's natural sea, pure wild seafood, ocean friendly, no preservatives, Oh, it has natural omega threes. Let me see. Sustainably caught. Mm. It's saying grown ups will like will will love. Okay. Uh, light and crispy bread and no fillers, no preservatives. It's a ten ounce package. You get about ten nuggets in here. It says they were ninety nine cents. Kind of beat up because I squeezed in my freezer. Y'all know the drill. <laughs> yeah, I said I was cutting back. I've been trying, but man, 
to get there and just man and i made the mistake of taking the kids with me the other day on friday i had a doctor's appointment i took them and we stopped at the 99 cent store over there and oh yeah they they went ham they begged for everything in the store all right next i have this uh nature rage farms right from the start organic gluten-free breaded chicken breast tenderloins okay it's the boneless skinless they're fully cooked it says keep frozen okay it's eight ounce package inspected by us it's usda uh usda organic chicken rage with no antibiotics ever no added hormones or steroids 100 percent vegetarian diet gluten-free all natural no preservatives so there's 99 cent never had it before but hey we're going to give it a try oh good expiration date june 28 2018 so that's pretty good all right moving along uh i think we got two different flavors i thought we did anyway we grab these we grab these sometime uh it's el monterey is the xx large beef and bean green chili burrito it's like a big giant burrito <laughs> i think the hubby be eating it like we got two of those i thought we got another flavor i don't know who knows okay i guess he didn't okay this is um this is the 505 southwestern mexi wraps <laughs> this is the chili mac and cheese wrap um it's a cheesy bit beef filling cheese sauce macaroni and a flour tortilla and um it's 12 grams of protein really not much i can tell you about it we got different flavors we got that flavor we got this one that says extra cheesy it's called cheesy chicken chalupa all right chicken monterey jack cheese and tomatillo salsa and a flour tortilla and then what other one we got this one is the spicy chicken wrap this is pinto beans chicken and, and cheddar cheese and a flour tortilla and they were all 99 cents by the way another one is called the beef and cheddar wrap pinto beans ground beef and cheddar cheese and a flour tortilla let me see if I one more oh wow is this a repeat yeah okay the cheesy chicken one i got two of those i don't know oh you know he, he probably did that i'm pretty sure it wasn't me all right i was also excited to find these again for the kids uh the lunchables with the 100 percent juice 13 grams of protein these are the chicken popper kebabs. um i think i had these in my last haul you get the little uh, mini chips ahoys um pretzel sticks 100% uh, Capri Sun juice. Like I said, I, I normally buy my kids 100% uh, juice pouches and juice boxes. Um, that's what I prefer. Some I did catch, like I said, the high C ones on sale, and I did grab those because it was such a good price. But normally, this is what I get: 100% juice. All right. Expiration date: April 8th, 2018. I grabbed two of those for my two little ones, of course. Yes. We also grabbed the Celeste pizza for one this is the original we got two of those and let me see what else did we grab okay yeah, i'm thinking about another story don't pay no attention to me y'all okay all right that's all perishable stuff right there all right over here uh today or yesterday now <laughs> technically i walked in and they had a big pallet full of juices and i was really shocked because i've been seeing people post that online at their store but my, well, one of my stores be BS and I don't, you know, and I'll be like, uh-uh, y'all taking all the stuff. But anyway, this particular store today, well, you know what, the big boss, she was there. I saw her. I don't know if she's the general manager. She's over the manager of the store, I just say that. <laughs> she must have been there rolling heads because they had all kind of beverages. So I just grabbed pretty much, I think, one of each. We got the Mini Maid Light 15 Calories Pink, uh, Light Pink Lemonade, 59 fluid ounce bottle for 99 cents. We also got the regular, um... Mini Maid Light, 15 calorie uh, light lemonade. Another 59 fluid ounce. Um, we also got the, the Dole 100% juice, the pineapple orange banana. This is 64 fluid ounce, no sugar added. Okay, and I also grabbed this. Um, it's a Tropicana Trop 50 um, juice, orange juice. It's, um, let me see, the one with some pulp. 100% uh, vitamin C, orange juice beverage with vitamins okay it's a 59 fluid ounce bottle they had this was the only type of orange juice type drink that they had so i just grabbed one of those because i you know i didn't really need a lot i don't have room for a lot anyway and then um we also ran into this um gold peak peach tea this was the only variety we found so we grabbed that uh, 59 fluid ounce bottle as well 
those were all 99 cents all right we also got this um um one touch latte the vanilla one finally because uh we had uh got the mocha previously a while back so we finally found the vanilla i saw everyone hauling international delight so yeah got that do i have a day yeah may 17 2018 all right also grabbed this uh core organic watermelon lemonade organic fruit infused beverage is usda uh usda or organic five calories per serving less than four grams of sugar look like something like that. i can't read it <laughs> don't even start me to line okay anyway yeah anyway we thought we'd give this a try this is a 18 fluid ounce bottle we only grabbed one of these all right and i could have grabbed more of those beverages like i said they had they even had that uh simply mixed berry um beverage too but i didn't care for the mixed berry one it didn't have a lot of flavor to me so i didn't grab that i was on a they had a lot out on the palette today too all right i finally found the ocean spray 100 percent organic cranberry juice uh no sugar added 100 percent vitamin c non-gmo this is a 33.8 ounce uh bottle i think i grabbed two of these let me count let me see one yeah i got two of those i got two of the cranberry and then i was lucky enough to run into the cranberry apple 100 percent juice also and it's organic it's new i mean you can't pass that up all of them are the same size they were all 99 cents i grabbed two of the cran apples i grabbed two of the cranberry and then the hubby of course was looking uh sideways because he wanted this uh the, the uh, cranberry blueberry so i only got one because i know him he was like, i'm gonna drink all i was like no we want to try it too so you know um he's gonna try to think he's gonna drink this to himself because he loves anything with blueberry but yeah i only grabbed one because i know him he had been took it to the head for real all right also ran into these i don't know it looks familiar the name but i'm not sure and they had a lot of different flavors i just thought about it you know what at the other store they had a lemonade one i think we didn't get that one i don't think Ugh. i'll see maybe i'll locate it so we was just interested in trying all the flavors it's ever fresh uh grape cranberry big 24 so was it 24 ounces this is a juice blend cocktail from concentrate Everfresh juice. This is like I said, they, it's a bunch of different flavors. Shake well refrigerated after opening. I don't know how anybody tasted this. Let me know how it tastes because I haven't tasted it yet. This it's a glass, it's in like a, a glass bottle. So we got this flavor. We also got the island punch flavor. Oh. And we got this peach mango flavor. I should have grabbed them the first time because I think they had all the flavors. <laughs> Dumb. <laughs> all right. And we got the fruit punch. And we got the strawberry banana. And I think if you watch, uh, follow me on Instagram, I have a lemonade one posted as well. So I think that's the flavor that's missing. So we just, I don't know. We would just like to try stuff. We wanted them type of people, I guess. <laughs> all right. Now, um, also ran into this right here. Um, it's Yum Earth Zinger, no oh Lord Jesus, Ginger Zest Flavor Organic Heart Candies. Um, let me see. So it's, I guess it's made from real ginger, I guess. It says gluten-free, uh, naturally flavored, no synthetic colors, made with real fruit juice, non-GMO. Uh, I never had these before. I saw them, but, you know, I thought they looked interesting, and I do love ginger, so... Thought we'd give them a try. They were 99 cents. Everything so far was 99 cents. If anything was different, I'll let you guys know. Anyway, so we're going to give these a try. I don't know if anybody else tried them out here. But yeah, I saw these. And I stumbled in one of my stores. And then another thing from Yum Earth are these uh, gummy bears. These are gluten-free. Uh, it's called Pomegranate Pucker. Sweet and simple. Uh, Non-GMO gluten-free. Made with organic cane sugar. No nuts flavored and colored with real fruit juice yeah so some little gummy bears got that one another yum earth product we got same thing basically they're gummy bears uh you get the pomegranate pucker the mango tangle perfectly peach strawberry smash hey and uh this it's also gluten free nut free naturally flavored no synthetic colors non-gmo made with real fruit juice you get five i guess i get five packs in here so yeah we got that and then we got another yum earth product we just went yum earth crazy huh 
all right this is the organic fruit fruit snacks um pineapple raspberry mango this one says it's vegan how cool is that mm, love it all right same thing all the nut free naturally flavored all that kind of good stuff you don't need to hear all that again and then we got this bigger one i guess all those have like five and this one has ten of course <laughs> we opened this one already today or yesterday or earlier and it's the same thing uh, prom uh pomegranate pucker mango tangle perfectly peach strawberry smash you get 10 of them in here uh, pretty much the same thing just get more it's a bigger pack so i would say it's a better value because you get more but not they were all 99 cents also couldn't resist grabbing these for my son like my kids they have a million fruit snacks as you saw from my previous hauls we still have a lot we've been going through them though and you get 10 pouches in here so it's not like an excellent value but my son loves anything cars and he loves cars and displays and so yeah i got it for him made with fruit puree 100 daily vitamin um daily value of vitamin c fat free it's gluten free so yeah grab those all right also grab these for my baby girl uh these are the goldfish uh baked snack crackers this is a mix um it's chocolate mint and pretzel she loves pretzels and i think i believe she likes chocolate and mint so um she was with me actually that day when i got it i showed it to her and uh yeah so we're gonna get those to try i was really excited because i think i saw people posting these and i know a lot of people have been doing a little um the the goju jang uh barbecue sauce so yeah uh i've never heard of this brand bib bib bibco bibgo it's a korean style go, goju jang barbecue sauce it says it's a glaze and brush and oh it says it's spicy you know we love anything spicy around here so yeah uh i'm really excited about this 11.5 ounces so yeah i was happy to find that and then i also got this right here by the same brand it's the korean style it's a modern authentic korean style barbecue a bulgogi i'm gonna mess that up sauce it's a, for your like a stir fry I mean, I'm a uh, y'all know I, I am, I'm afraid to even look at the sodium in here, so I'm not gonna even put myself on blast like that with my blood pressure. I just wanted to try it, so yeah, we'll, we'll check it out. We were excited to find these as well. It's the Welch's um, family former owned, refreshingly simple, no artificial sweeteners, no preservatives, no HFCC, no HFCS, <laughs> the strawberry banana flavored juice beverage blend okay what else 59 fluid ounce bottle we actually got two of these we bought one in the hook i guess it's <laughs> didn't realize we already had and i kept telling him he thought it was a different flavor so we actually ended up with two of these also this is the ocean spray uh cran mango we love the cran mango the cran pineapple we love all of them 100 vitamin c so yeah 64 fluid ounce uh bottle we got two of these 100 calories per serving so yeah find that the 99 cent store was definitely an excellent deal especially with that organic stuff too i'm pretty sure that's or anything organic usually costs more so even though that one's not organic but you know hey my daughter for some reason likes the hair so i always tease her i don't like arizona tea you know i'm a gold peak girl so anyway this is um the mucho mango it's a 42 fluid ounce and it was um, 99 cent and they had a sweet tea one but i didn't grab that one i guess i should have and uh yeah and that's how that went down Oh, I don't know if you remember these from a previous haul. These um, wafers, boo, is it Balduco? Wafer bites. This is a chocolate with hazelnut. I really love these. So, yeah, it's 99 cents. I hadn't grabbed none in a while. So, I just happened to grab it. And I had no business grabbing me. And the hubby was going to share this earlier. Little Reese's with the Reese's pieces in it. I think it's like 79 cents. And then uh, I grabbed more of these, uh, the king size mint, uh, uh, Oreo chocolate candy bar for my daughter. So, yeah. She loves those, so yeah, got, got her those again, a little treat. And then, oh, we stumbled in across these, um, I never tried this brand before. This is not my go-to brand, but I hope they work. You know, holiday coming up later today, or it's actually, oh, happy Easter, everybody, by the way. <laughs> I meant to say that. I'll say it again later. Uh, Nature's Cup Board, you get um, 12 brown and served dinner rolls. My daughter, she loves them. We are a dinner roll household. On holiday, we buy like millions of dinner rolls. We buy a lot of them. So to catch them for 99 cents was pretty good. Uh, no uh, high fructose um, corn syrup. No artificial colors or flavors. Best before April 5th. Okay, yeah, that, they'll be gone. We grabbed actually... Well, I got some for my aunt, too. So, we got, like, I think we got a total of, like, six of these. <laughs> yeah. 
Uh-huh. Yeah. Yeah, for real, for real. Alright, let me see. Oh, okay. Maybe I can say... Oh! Y'all, I had a... I don't know what happened to me earlier. I'm in the store, and I'm looking at this... Uh, this is some champagne. I'm so stupid. <laughs> it says Dom Perrier. And I guess, for some reason, I don't know a lot about, you know, liquor and wine and stuff. A little bit. You know, a little something. I do have a little collection going on upstairs, but... I, I thought, I don't know, I guess I got it mixed up with Dom Perrier, uh, per, no, Dom Perrion. <laughs> this is Dom Perrier, and I thought it was Dom Perrier, it was like $4.99, and I grabbed it, I'm thinking, like, and I'm uh, talking to one of my, um, friends that I see when I go shopping, and she's like, oh yeah, you can make some, um, some mimosas, because you got the orange juice, I was like, oh yeah, I sure can, and I'm thinking I got something fabulous, so I don't know, y'all, this, this is obviously a fake one, anyway, I just grabbed it, but you know, I still was going to share with you guys. All right, I don't think it's nothing special. All right, we also grabbed these. Let me move this up my way. Hostess, um, strawberry cupcakes. You get eight indi individually wrapped cakes. Expiration date is April twentieth, two thousand eighteen. It's a limited edition, you guys. I've never had the strawberry. I don't know if I had these before or not. Anyway, you know, I'm sure my family is gonna try those. Give those a try. Alright, I also have posted a picture of these on my Instagram, and uh, who is it? I think it's 99B Poppin'. She was like, oh yeah, those are so good, and, and that's a good deal because at Walmart you get two rolls, and they're like, two of these little things, and they're like a dollar something, 134, 130 something, or whatever. So let me see, I never had these before, and I'm like, are they good? She said, yeah, the sweet ones are really good. So I said, okay, well, if I see them again, I'll try them. So I went back, and I happened to see them, uh... It says it's a crunchy rice snack. I never had these before. This is the honey cinnamon. No preservatives, no artificial colors or flavors. Gluten-free ingredients used. And she said they're like low calories too. So that's what really caught my attention. That they taste good and they're low calories. <laughs> so I got that variety. And I also got this one. It says sweet. Sweet crunchy rice snack. So yeah. I don't know. Well, I'm going to try them and see if, the, if I like them. You guys. Have any of you guys tried these before? Oh and this one right here says it's vegan. So basically this one is vegan, so how cool is that you guys? Alright, cool. Alright. Yep. For all y'all vegan people. Alright. Oh my god, I was so excited when I saw these. Because last time I hauled these, they were the reduced fat ones. And I was like, I don't know. But I was just, this is the brand I use for my banana pudding. This by Nabisco. These are vanilla wafers. This is my go-to brand. So yeah. Actually, I grabbed, I think we got one, two, three, four. I think we got four boxes of these. Yeah, four boxes. These are the Nilla wafers for 99 cents. That's an excellent deal. Trust me, I know because I buy them every time. My son, he asks me, Mom, can you make me a banana pudding? Yep, I already know how it goes down. So that was an excellent deal. Okay, I never bought these before. I see these all the time. I see people grabbing them. I guess they got like some fruit looking one. Like a, it kind of remind me of a fruit cake. So you know, I ain't gonna grab no fruit cake. Mm -mm, I don't do that. Anyway, it says made with Hershey's uh, milk chocolate chips it was $1.99 I wasn't happy about the price but it's Choco Tone I don't know is this like Italian or something specialty cake I'll be seeing people grab them so we decided to go ahead and try especially since they had this chocolate chip one I can probably try that and dig that better than a fruit cake looking one mm -mm. anyway it's moist and fresh so anybody tried this let me know but I'm, we're going to give it a try and see if it's a hit or a miss around here because I just see it all the time so yeah decided to grab it all right Okay, is that all the food products? I believe right now. Okay, moving along. Oh no, I found it. I bought uh, about six of these. My aunt, I was talking to her and she's like, did you see any uh, peaches? Cause I guess she's planning on making a peach cobbler. So yeah, these are the uh, Libby's Yellow Queen uh, peach slices. I think I got about six of these in heavy syrup. And I think one of them was in some kind of white juice or something. Anyway, you guys almost forgot. <laughs> I stumbled across this uh, Ghirardelli, um, let's say Ghirardelli chocolate, but it's the caramel premium sauce, so yeah, um, uh, made with real caramel, so yeah, um, it's a 17 ounce bottle, so yeah, we're gonna definitely, uh, give this a try. Oh, excuse my nose. Okay, you guys, I grabbed some more of them pencils, these are the Premier 6 count pencils, just a different design than the last ones I grabbed. And I don't know why the hubby grabbed these, but they are kind of cute, but don't tell them all about it. Because I think I already have some from the Dollar Tree. But anyway, these are some Crystal Stylus 
uh, and it's a crystal styling ink pen. So it's a pen and it's a stylus, but it got like some little shimmery looking. Thing. Don't tell him I said it, but I, they're cute, but I was not going to grab them. <laughs> anyway, I'll tell him that. Okay, so, and this right here is a studio art. I could have sworn we grabbed some of these before, but maybe he grabbed some more. These are the permanent markers. Because, see, I'm used to getting the Sharpie brand. I don't know what this brand, uh, how this brand works, but it's a six count, so we'll give it a try. I don't know why he grabbed those. I have no idea, y'all. I was really excited about this. This is, um, it's like a face paint, some face painting sticks. I don't even know how to paint, but we're going to try to mess up the kid's face and try to paint my daughter. She's pretty great. I'll let her do it. I guess this one's more like, um, I'm going to say like more like girl colors. It's really cute. You get what? Six of them? One, two, no, five. Yeah. No, you get six. Yeah, six. And then this one looked more like boy colors. But of course you can, you know, use any one. I just wanted to get different colors. So these were 99 cents as well. And I also got these. Um, these are Barbie uh, Dreamtopia. You can be anything. This one looks like little cherries. It's cute. Aw. For my daughter. And... I got more of these. This one right here, what is this? Is it like a marshmallow or something? A candy? I don't know what this one is. I'm not sure. Maybe just three and over. We got more. Where are the rest of them at? Hmm. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna have to locate the other one. Cause we got like a strawberry and a watermelon or something. Okay, when I locate it, I'll let y'all know. I got these for my son. These are uh, Disney Pixar, Pixar cards. These are the mini racers. So I guess each one is different. Oh, okay, real die cast car inside. So yeah, I got, I think these are probably going in his little, um, what you call it, Easter basket. So I'll throw that in there for him. He tried to help me make it earlier, y'all. <laughs> All right, I grabbed more of the Smoke and Mirrors products. Um, this is the, uh, what is it? Fuller Lips in Seconds. This is like the lip plumper thing. What did it say? Long lasting results. Sandy New, because I had a, a uh, grab a clear one and then I found this one and this one is like um, the clear one crystal clear crystal clear I can't afford the injections y'all no I'm just kidding <laughs> actually we grabbed two of these these are the highlighters I don't know where the other ones at but my daughter opened it and tried it this one is let's say buildable color this is um moonlight pearl and the other one was a almost kind of a yellow or goldish looking color I'm not sure where it is but anyway we opened it they were 99 cents and look what I found you guys I never find these. These are the Cream Shop um, Beauty Blenders. The lovely blending sponge for, sponge for lovely people. They had different ones, so I just grabbed one of each. This is like the pink one. I'm not sure the difference between them. My daughter may know. And this is the one in the green package, whatever. This is the one in like uh, lavender purple package. So they were 99 cents. So yeah, I was pretty excited. Still haven't found those Cream Shop brushes except for that one that one of my little shopping buddies gave me. Uh, other than that, can't locate them, but I found these today, so or yesterday or whatever. Okay, we got these for my son. These are the Star Wars Rogue One Partition X Wing Fighter. Great for track. Hot Wheels, anyway. So, yeah, you know how he do his Hot Wheels and stuff. And then we also got him this one, the Striker, it says. And let me see, we got him this one, Rebel U, U Wing Fighter. Okay, yeah, well, anyway. This is boy stuff. I don't know nothing about it. <laughs> and these right here were $1.99. Pull back and let it rip. Some kind of customize your vehicle. Okay, you put stickers on it and stuff. I thought we thought he'd, he'd enjoy that. Motorized max speed over 200 scale miles per hour. I don't know what it is. Some boy cars. That's all I know. <laughs> I grabbed some more of these little. Um, this is the fresh linen scented um, sach sachet. Satchel? Sachet. But anyway, envelope. You know, you can put these in your closet or your, um, you know, little clothes chest or whatever to make it smell good or whatever in your drawer. And then I had grabbed one of these last time for myself. And then this time I grabbed one for my daughter, the Swifter uh, Duster, little duster kit. Yeah, dusting kit. Uh, yeah, I guess it has everything in there. Yeah, I just grabbed her one for her house. And then we grabbed more of these. I didn't realize we grabbed more of these. Anyway, the, um, Arm and Hammer, it said it fits the Airwick Arglaze Senate oil warmers. We bring a lot of our, our plugins, you know. We, we do use those all the time. And we found, I gotta find my other, did we find another one? Maybe not. Anyway, we got some more of the Versace. Um, these are like the men's, uh, what do they call these? 
Mm. Anyway, a little slip on, no show, little sock things or whatever. Yeah, they were $1.99. And then we also found socks in the Versace. I don't know how authentic they are or whatever, but these are actually two pack of socks. These cost more. As you see, these were $2.99. The other ones were $1.99. And that Airwick, um, the little air freshener armor hammer, as you saw, was $1.99 as well, y'all. Yeah. Forgot to mention these socks were $1.99. These are brat socks. I got these for my daughter. It's a bunch of different patterns. And uh, here are more of the another variety of the Versace socks. $2.99. And then we got these, another pattern of the Versace men socks. Um, that was $2.99 as well. I'm still trying to locate my other one. I know it's around here somewhere. I'm gonna have to find it. Maybe I'll move some of this stuff. Okay, another pattern of the Versace socks right here. Oh, this has two different colors in it, I guess. Yeah, those ones don't, they're all the same, right? All right, anyway, that was $2.99. And then what is this? Okay, our little, uh, you know, the Arthur George, Rob Kardashian socks. Got that one. And then we got my daughter these little Minnie Mouse socks. They were $1.99. I think you, each of those, I think you get like six pairs in there or something. Let me see. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, about six pairs. And then we got her these right here. These are the Secret Life of Pets. They were $1.99, these socks as well. And then um, I happened to get these. Uh, it's a Captain captain collection they were $1.99 one size fits most um they're look like about 35 inches in length loose cut someone was telling me these would be good for like a a swim cover up or you know however you want to wear i was planning on giving it to my aunt and uh the other one i'm not sure i'll probably maybe i'll give her two who knows they have some but actually um when the, the lady hit me and told me they had came in i sent the hubby and these are the patterns he picked out then i went myself and i see some cuter colors and designs so i was like man uh, he can't pick out stuff like women can i would have picked out different patterns but they're all right i guess they were this is another one it was 1.99 as well oh found another pair of socks uh this is a different pattern of color yeah anyway and then uh he grabbed this he said oh honey i gotta get this for you, you will love it um some kind of then he said it was a scarf, but when he got it home, it said it was a kimono. It was $1.99 as well. It is a pretty pattern. It's really pretty. Pretty colors. You see that, you guys? See, yeah, it's pretty. I guess he did all right on that one. I guess. It would be better if he brought me some diamonds. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> all right. Okay. And um, we thought this was pretty interesting. Uh, flipping fantastic. Uh, fast and easy fun. Uh, make seven pancakes at once. Uh, you can make pancakes with it. Uh, makes perfectly shaped pancakes without the mess. I usually make mine on my cast iron griddle. But anyway, uh, look like you can make other stuff too. Where's the pictures? Yeah, look, hash browns. Excuse me. Omelets, butterfingers, huh? Eggs and more. So yeah, they said as seen on TV. I didn't see it on TV, but you know that's what it says. Like I said, I don't even really watch commercials. I fast forward. And then we saw these flip flops. They were 99 cent. Got these. And the kids just put these on today. My daughter put these on today. That color. And my son put these on today. Just some basic flip flops. And then these are my daughter. She hasn't tried these yet. Like little unicorns and other little symbols. And then I even got us grown up some. And then I saw this uh, preschool scholar book by School Zone. And it's the ages three to five. My son's five and he's getting ready to start school. It's coming fall. So yeah. I decided to get that uh, for him. It was $1.99. I wasn't happy about the price. I mean, but for, when it comes to educational stuff, you know, you can't really put a price on that. So, yeah, I got this for my son. Also got these Ninja Turtle, like, water bottles for the kids. This is really cute, y'all. How y'all like that? Say Turtle Power. I got two of them, one for each kid, you know, so they won't be fighting over it. You know how they do. Fight over everything, man. All right. Also got this um, Jello Jiggler Zoo Mold, so they're gonna enjoy making these. I got two of them out of here. I don't know was it really supposed to be two, but hey, we got two of them. No molds to make Jello. We have plenty of Jello, so they'll have fun doing that. I also kept looking at these, and I had post pictures on my Instagram, and I kept thinking about it, and I decided to go on and grab it. I didn't like the price of $3.99, but I guess it's like the little washi tape type stuff. Um, you get 30 different patterns of tape for my daughter. So we'll try to figure out a project or something 
with her to do with these. I thought it was really cute. It was by Barbie. Barbie and Princess Power. Okay. Yeah, so I thought it was really cute. I didn't like the price. And then, oh, I could have swore we grabbed this one, but Bobby said we didn't. These are the legal pads. They're $2.99, and you get 12 of them. That's a lot. This heavy by Mead. So, yeah, uh huh. We grabbed those. My son begged for this. I do say age is six and over, and he's only five, but you know, we'll supervise him. It's like a remote control car street tuner. It was $4.99. So, he grabbed this and he started falling down the store and acting the fool. So, I just went on and got and it. And then um, I saw these right here. It's a, it's a Mixtronic HD TV compatible flat antenna and your free digital signal. It was $2.99. So, um, they had a purple one too. Um, I was talking to my aunt about it and she was looking for an antenna. So I don't even know how these things work. You know, I have direct TV and then I have my fire stick. <laughs> so I don't, you know, know do we even need this. I probably let my aunt use it. Let's say 1080p, whatever it is, 1080i and 720p. Ultra thin, lightweight design, multi surface, mm -hmm. universal mm -hmm. suction cup stand. No extra power needed. So I don't know how these work. Some kind of flat antenna and your free digital signals. I don't know how it works and it has the stuff. So we'll see. I also kept seeing these and seeing people haul them. And so I finally decided to give one a try. It's the right on LED light box. And you can, I guess, I don't know how you write the stuff on. Do you need like a chalk or something or a marker? Anyway, it was $3.99, you guys. So I thought, thought we'd give it a try. I only grabbed one. And then I grabbed this um, shower curtain liner. I've been wanting to grab these for a while by Truly Home. It says the hotel weight shower curtain liner. They were $1.99. So we grabbed this. Because I'm going to be most likely redoing, um, redecorating both bathrooms soon. So yeah, I grabbed that. And then this is the same brand, but it's a shower curtain. And it was $1.99 as well. I kept seeing these. And I don't know the difference between the two. But I grabbed both of them because I don't know the difference. This is the rock solo and this is the pop solo. If y'all know the difference, let me know. This both will be uh, Bluetooth karaoke microphones. This one says 201 Designs. This one says black built in retractable. So I guess you put your little phone or something on there and sing or pretend like we can sing. Y'all want me to sing for y'all? No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> yeah, y'all don't want me to sing for y'all. So yeah, they were $5.99 each. So yeah, I thought we'd give them a try and see, you know, how they work. Cause I have absolutely no idea. Okay, I also grabbed this um, accent rug for my daughter's by what? Great Graydon Hall Jacket Fleece Accent Rug. It's like a gray and white. They had some other colors today. I think I saw yesterday. I saw a black and white. I think they had a, like a lavender white, like a sea foam green or blue and white. So um, um, she said she wanted this one. She happened to be with me. Cause like I said, all the kids with me cause we were I had a doctor's appointment and took them with me. Biggest mistake of my life. I be wondering when I see them acting the fool, I be like, see, this is why I don't leave, take my kids. We saw somebody today with their kid falling out and I was like, see, this is why I don't even take my kids with me when I go shopping. Sorry, y'all, this is so random and ratchet. Uh, I don't know where the car, but my son saw this and he, so this is the price, it was $7.99. The other rug for my daughter, that one, that, I don't know if I said the price, the Jack, um, accent rug, the grand white one, that was $9.99. This children's play rug was, um, $7.99. I don't know. It's just like a children's flavor. It's really light. It feels kind of like a... I'm about to knock some stuff down. Foam. It's, it's really lightweight and everything. But my son was so fascinated with it. He just kept grabbing it. We kept saying, no, mom got to haul it. And next thing we know, he just took it. And we just like, just let him have it. He started driving his cars on the track. Like, he has a similar rug. It's like a, a track type of rug. Actually, we got from Ikea. I don't remember how much we paid for it. And I bought my daughter one. Hers is like a hopscotch rug, but she they waste some red juice or something on this. So I, I had to take her rug out the room. I got to go back to Ikea. But I thought this was cool. It's supposed to be for both kids, but he's actually taken over this because it has a little track on it and a little city. So he, he thinks it's his by himself. So anyway, sorry it's unwrapped, you guys, but it was $7.99. He just, you know, he wanted, he's a boy. Like, he likes all that kind of stuff. So it's really cute. It's not, it, it, it feels like a foam. It doesn't, like the rug he has from Ikea, and the rug I've got my daughter from Ikea, they feel like a rug. This feels, I don't know, like a foam. <laughs> like really lightweight though. And then I'll also grab this um, Jacker S Accent Mat. It was $1.99 by the same brand as my daughter's um, rug. I just needed something where I'm going from my hardwood floors to the kitchen. And I thought this was really cool. Um, it's a little reusable bag. 
and it says Black Panther. And <laughs> my son, he grabbed this one. He saw me bring this, and he thinks this is his. So I don't know how this is gonna go, y'all. Who gonna win? It was 99 cents. These, uh, they're like, I guess it's like a beach tote or something, I will say. That's what I'm calling it, a beach tote. Look how cute this is with the margarita. Can't y'all see me walking on the beach with a margarita? Hell no, I ain't walking on the beach. <laughs> but anyway, um, I probably will go to the beach on my walking on the beach. But anyway, uh, what does it say? It says lime and salt. And it's like a margarita. And this thing is huge, you guys. And it feels like a really good quality. These were, how much were these? That's a good question. Two ninety nine. Yeah, they weren't ninety nine cents. I'm like, but yeah, they, it's like huge. It's really, really big. It has a nice strap. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the girl gonna be looking cute with this. This one is really cute too. Like I said, all these were two ninety nine. They got the purple straps, and it looks like I said, it seems pretty durable. It has that, you know, material. It doesn't seem like this is gonna easily break. So I think this is an excellent deal. And this is huge. You can get a lot of, I like these. I'm, I really like these. My daughter thinks she's stealing. We gonna fight over this one. Nah, but she can have it. She gonna be looking cute on the beach. The back is like all black. It's really cute. This thing is huge. Uh, she saw this. That's how my son ended up with that remote control car for $4.99. Because this right here was $5.99. She was like, Mom, can I get it? I'm like, oh my God. Why did I, I really lost my mind bringing them with me. I don't know what I was thinking. There. I got it. I had the reach, but I don't know what the heck I was doing. Cause see, he did it for us in the store. So, anyway, how cool is this? It's a little unicorn. Lights up. It's really cute. And she saw they had other colors and you know other ones. But yeah, this is the one she selected. So, yeah, I was in that store. I must have spent like about ninety. I was like, uh -uh, I ain't coming with the kids no more. I already be spending too much money myself. And they had them little suckers begging for stuff. Yeah, but it's fine. It's really cute. So. You have a little girl or you want a gift idea for somebody this is yeah it's really cool so let me see if i can turn it off so you basically it's the on off switch here and uh yeah that's how you turn it on and off i might do a quick video of them all because i was making um easter baskets today for the kids i bought these um but i'm i'm not finished wrapping these up uh these cups uh, they're zach uh commitment to child safety they're bpa free this has like anna and elsa and then Olaf, my son thinks he's Olaf because when I took them to Frozen, Frozen Disney on Ice, I got these for the kids. So this, but it's in the Easter basket for my daughter I'm making. All right, I saw someone post these. These are by Hot Wheels and it's like the 50, I don't know, some kind of 50 edition. Anyway, so I got these for my son. He saw these and threw them in his Easter basket, y'all. I guess he knew they were, and it's a collection. It's six of them. We got all six. We did get all six. This is the Roger Dodger, whatever that is. I ain't heard of that. <laughs> and um bone shaker anyway they're all some old like cars 65 ford ranchero and twin mill whatever it is anyway we got the whole collection we got all six he threw them in his easter basket that i'm making for him and then we also got this like a little sheriff it's a hot wheels sheriff car that's in his easter basket as well and then he got this one this cup like my daughter got and he got the one that's the secret life of pets and uh if i do the quick video to you tomorrow then you'll see that my kids they have bag and basket i did this last year in lake tahoe they had so much stuff that i got them so i'm gonna show you guys what i put in there but i'm gonna show you guys later because uh, i gotta end this video so yeah i'll show you guys what they got in their baskets and bags later Okay, y'all, this is the fun part. This is the exciting part is the giveaway winner, uh, announcement winners. Uh, whatever, giveaway winners announcement. <laughs> I'm supposed to say it. It's late. I'm tired. So my okay. daughter um, downloaded an app called Popsicle Sticks or something like that. So we entered everyone who entered to get who did it correctly. We entered everyone's name. And then the people that were following me on Instagram, but some people actually really was supposed to have three entries because they entered on the Dollar Tree video and a 99 cent store video and they're following me on Instagram. But, um, you know, but I only entered them twice anyway still. So the people who got entered twice had a better chance of winning actually. So one person, that one of the winners actually won on their second one because it wouldn't let you enter duplicate names. So we had to put like their name. And then when we enter for the second entry, we put their name and the number two behind it. And one of the people won off their second entry. So it pays to do all that. So the winners are, uh, and this is a person who definitely comments all the time and follows me on Instagram. Uh, sh I'm gonna mess up her name. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, beautiful. I'm sorry, love. <laughs> Shaprita Day K. 
California Day California. I think her name on Instagram is Lapita or something like that. Beautiful young lady um, who always um, likes my posts on Instagram. She comments all the times, and she she was she got two entries, so she won. So you're you're my first winner. And then when we hit the button again, then I couldn't record it because my daughter had it downloaded on her phone, which she's recording me on. But next time we'll do it where you can see me actually select the winners. Really, the app selected the winners. And my second winner, I'm really excited about this one too, was Sway to the 99. And he won on his second entry because when it popped up, it says Sway to the 99 too. So it was his second entry that actually helped helped him win. And I know you guys always hear me shout him, shout him out. And I'm happy that he won. I'm happy for all the winners, you know, both of the winners, you know. So um, I probably won't be doing my next big giveaway until I hit 1,000 subscribers. But I am planning on doing some surprise giveaways along the way. So be on the lookout for that. Um, actually... I believe next week me and Vienna Rodriguez um, is going to be doing a collaboration video and um, you know look out for that you know uh, we may have a giveaway coming up with that so stay tuned for that um, anyway if you're not already please uh, follow me on Instagram it's, it's the same handle the mom life 7 follow sway to the 99 on Instagram um, he won and he's um, you know he's a very big supporter of mine and um Vienna Rodriguez, she's on Instagram and YouTube. And also uh 99 Cent and More, 99 Cent Store and More, I believe that's her name. On Instagram, she posts a lot of uh nice finds. And 99 be popping. There's other people, it's a ton of other people. I can't think of everybody's name offhand right now. But anyway, yeah, make sure you're following those people on Instagram and uh, watching their posts because they post a lot of fabulous finds. And um hope I didn't forget anything or anybody like I said uh, I got some more videos coming up for you guys so stay tuned for that uh, congratulations to my winners Chaprita de California de California I'm sorry girl if I messed up your name beautiful I'm so sorry and sway to the 99 uh, handsome young man down in the San Francisco Bay Area who posts a lot of his finds on Instagram he's not on YouTube like we can just have a channel or nothing like that but yeah anyway those are the two winners so uh, I'm going to be sending off, uh, you guys have to, because it's tec technically, it's tec technically, it's Sunday. So, I guess I can give you guys probably till like Tuesday to uh, get your mailing information to me, you guys. So, I can send, uh, I'll be shipping you guys, um, um, whatever you want, off to you guys next week. I, was, I kept saying, like, what do I do if a man won, and now a man won, so I got to think of, oh my god, man stuff, so... <laughs> hopefully I'll be in contact with him and see what he likes and know he might and you know you can give give the stuff away gift it out keep it do what you want with it I mean you want it so it's yours hope I didn't forget anything sorry that the video took a while y'all so long I, I was actually going to film it in two parts because I'm trying to get my videos to be like you know shorter maybe my haul videos no more than 20 to 25 minutes if I could do 15 minutes it'd be great you know, I, I did tell you guys I was cutting back and I tried to cut back, but I blame this on my kids because I made the mistake of taking them with me to the store and they beg for little, literally, literally everything thing in the floor. Even my 23 year old is friendly. You were, yes, you did. You were begging too. <laughs> she was begging too, y'all. That's my, she was my baby until I had my seven year old. So she was used to being a baby. So yeah, she even begged. And I had my other kids calling me and you know, they're begging. They all beg. All seven of them beg, y'all. I'm telling y'all. So anyway, I really appreciate all you guys. Thank you, thank you, thank. Like I said, I have the list. I believe all the names we entered, and once we the winners popped up, we circled them. So, congratulations to the winners. Um, and um, let me see. I hope I didn't forget anything. Look out for me and Ben Rodriguez in our collab video, and support everyone on YouTube. It's a lot of wonderful people out there. A lot of beautiful people out there. A lot of beautiful creators. Just support everyone and give everybody love and good vibes. And I hope I didn't forget anything, you guys. Um, anyway, I hope you guys enjoy my haul. And please, you guys, give me a thumbs up. Please support me. You know, I love everyone. I support all you guys back. And even people I haven't got to your video yet or uh, your channel yet, I'm coming. I'm just behind on everything. I got these kids here for two weeks. My daughter's been out of school all week. She's on spring break for two weeks. Two weeks. We only got one week when I was in school. So anyway, uh, let me get this stuff in the freezer and the freezer ready and put all my perishable stuff back up. And um, hopefully I don't forget anything. I, I do have some cooking videos coming up, even though it's Easter Sunday now, and I didn't get a chance to get because I was about to I was about to pump out some some dishes for y'all. But 
Hopefully by the time the holiday season come, you know, the Thanksgiving and Christmas out. But I'm going to get some more recipes out before that, I promise. It just maybe won't be holiday themed too much. But, you know, hey, it is what it is. All right. I hope I didn't forget anything. And I will see you guys in the next one.